Uh, my name is Cassandra Osborne and I'm the founder of a brand called Herness Project and we make um, sleep and loungewear basics. We make t-shirts, um, joggers, shorts, long sleeves and a dress and a um, duster for sleeping slash lounging and we try to bridge the gap from lounge to everyday as well. I guess what we do for the world is bring garments to life in an ethical and sustainable fashion from a from a baseline promise. And that baseline promise was that we would use fibers and develop them into fabrics in um, a sustainable way. So Green Story measures the impact that our clothing has as compared to a basic cotton t-shirt, let's say, as we you know, compare apples to apples. So it measures the impact of actually only one of our fibers, um, which is tensile, um, against um, the impact of a regular t-shirt made, made with um, regular cotton. So it gives our um, consumers a tangible way of looking at the difference that the choice between a Hernest um, sleep t-shirt and a you know, regular t-shirt would have. For us, they're measuring the water, the uh, driving, and the um, LED impact. Green Story also adds those widgets right onto our product pages so that the consumer can see in terms of, you know, right on the product page what the impact of purchasing that, that garment is. Mainly what I want to say is that the water consumption has been the one that has been the most impactful for me in terms of making choices. I feel that it's important for the consumer to see what resources they are saving by making a purchase. To me it's important as a tool for measuring what decisions you're making in the world and how that can be tangibly understood from, from a consumer point of view. And even if that consumer doesn't end up choosing a Hernest garment, I feel like at least it puts the idea into their head that that green, greener, more sustainable choices do have significant impact. Right now in marketing, and it, this is historically true for anything you wanna say in marketing, there's no overseeing, there's no overseeing body to, to the actual word sustainability. So by defining what we mean by sustainability, by having a um, tangible way of calculating it and letting the consumer see what that means, um, it holds us accountable for the choices that we're making, but also gives um, transparency to the consumer on, on what we mean by sustainability. The word sustainability and green and all these, you know, are being thrown around a lot lately and, you know, asking ourselves what do we mean by that and how are we measuring that is an important link to make. People coming back and saying, wow, that is really cool. I didn't know that you could measure that or there was a way for me to see this. Is it impacting their purchasing decisions? I think for some of my consumers, absolutely, because it gives credibility to what we are saying and what we're doing. And to other consumers, it is a, okay, this is, this is, this is something I need to think about. This is something I need to pay attention to. And um, it's great that they're highlighting this. You know, I'm working with Green Story on one fiber right now, but I've, and it's really helped me to understand my fiber choices and how I'm blending those fibers actually makes a difference. And for me, the, the more information that I learn and, and the more that I get to know. It, there's two important relationships there. One for me and the customer, giving me, giving some transparency to what I'm doing to the customer, but also for me personally, and as I evolve her nest, is how do we get those numbers to show up even better? And um, that's equally as important for me. It gives a, a great visual of when you're on a product page to really drive home the point that the consumer has the power to make informed decisions about their impact. And a lot of the customers that come to Her Nest or shop on our website are looking for sustainable options and 
the impact that it has is it gives um, credibility to what we're saying in terms of sustainability, but also gives the consumer the power to make an informed decision, which is helping me to understand what, where I need to go to next and how I need to innovate those fabrics um, to the next level so that, so that those green impacts and those widgets start to look even better and better. And so right now I have a baseline and it makes me feel like I am doing something right, but there's also the next level to get to.